Okay, hi again. I uh, wasn't too satisfied with what I did uh, earlier. So, here's uh, another take on the wicking for the EOS. Uh, what I've done is I took the wick I made earlier on the first video and I sleeved it with a 2mm echo uh, very carefully of course and uh, now I'm going to show how I built the coil over it okay put the entire wick through the the needle that was used to make the wick okay 30 gauge uh, counter wire okay. and I'm just going to wrap some micro coils over it Okay. And this time I'm going for uh, six five rep, okay. Instead of the uh, seven six I did earlier. So when you're working with uh, echo wool, you got to be very careful not to uh, fray up the sleeve. Okay. Okay. Quite happy with mine now. Okay. And now I'm going to transfer it to the AO stack. It's probably easier if you add some juice to the loose phrase. Okay. Okay, now it's sitting in there nicely. Oops. Okay, so test fire. I just adjust the width to the center, more to the center. Okay, the uh, Advantages of using uh, echo sleeves uh, over mesh is that you know you don't have to worry much about hot spots. You know. Okay.
Okay, now just uh, trim the ex excess off with a new clipper and uh, the freeze at the top as well. and uh, tuck in the loose frays at the, the deck area if you wish you can trim it off but I can't be bothered okay and then you fit everything back Okay, and now I'm going to top up the juice for like the 1000 time. Okay, give it a few draws before you fire. <laughs> <laughs> 